Hello viewers, we'll be going over WTI crude oil, in this video we'll be going over my trade idea of the week and the day by day probability model. So let's start off with the technical analysis on the 1 hour chart. We remain in pause MACD, seeing signs of a converge and we're still near overbought levels with the RSI. As we extend out to the 4 hour chart, we remain in pause MACD and at overbought conditions with the RSI. If we extend out with the daily chart, we remain in pause MACD and at overbought levels with the RSI. As for support, that will be where we had resistance in the past that dated back to August 26. And since we're above resistance, that now act as our support and that is around a price of $43.41. If we were to test that support level, that price movement to the downside is roughly around 4.7%. And as for resistance, we would have to examine the weekly chart, and that is this orange line, or the 100 weekly moving average, which is at the price of $48.53. If we were to test that resistance, that price movement to the upside is roughly around 5.6%. So for the trade idea of the week, I'll be trading USL, and what we have here is my position size, for USL will be less than 1% of my portfolio and my long entry will be at $15.26 which is this range right here. My sell target is $16.62 and my stop loss will be at $14.77. On the other hand, if I were to open a short position, my entry will be at $16.96 and my stop loss or sell target will be $15.77. And the stop loss will be at $17.32. So whichever entry price were to hit first, that will be my position of the week. So how did I develop these trade ideas? It all comes from the day-by-day -day probability model, which is available in the link below. So do check it out. As we progress to the fifth day or week of trading, we have a 60% chance for WTI crude oil to climb between 0 to 5.3%. As for downside, we have a 40% chance to fall between 0 to negative 5.3%. So if you enjoyed this content, feel free to like, comment, subscribe, and thank you for watching.